Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use image inputs inside ChatGPT using the Scene Explain ChatGPT plugin that it lets you attach images to your prompts and interact with those images. So before I would show you how to use the Scene Explain plugin to use image inputs in your ChatGPT prompts, first let's talk about some of the use cases of the Scene Explain ChatGPT plugin. So on my website rihex.com, I have a full tutorial on this plugin, and one of the things I cover are the best use cases you can use this plugin with. So if you want to learn more about how you can use image inputs inside the ChatGPT using this plugin, there are some use cases here. So you can use this for image analysis, object identification, scene description, content moderation, image-based search and more. And in this article, I also share the best prompts you can use this plugin with and use ChatGPT with image inputs inside your ChatGPT prompts. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. All right, so now let's see a quick example on how to use image inputs using this scene explain ChatGPT plugin. So as you might know, you have to be a ChatGPT Plus subscriber to be able to use GPT-4 and plugins. If you don't have a Plus subscription, of course you can upgrade, but if you do not have the money, I have another tutorial where I show you how to use a ChatGPT-like platform to use images in your AI conversations. So if you cannot use ChatGPT for this, there is still a workaround, and in that video I show you how to use that software and still use images in your ChatGPT conversations. But now let's see how to use this uh, Scene Explain plugin to do that. So first what you have to do is enable plugins in your ChatGPT account, if you haven't done that yet, and then click on New Chat, then select GPT-4 from the model selector. Then if the plugin is not installed, you have to install the Scene Explain ChatGPT plugin. And in that case, you have to click on plugin store and install the plugin. I have already done that. So all I have to do is enable the plugin and I can do that by selecting the checkbox next to the name of the plugin. Right now the plugin is enabled. So let's see a prompt with an image input. So as an example, we're gonna use this image where two people are handing a stack of money. And let's see if ChatGPT is able to recognize what is on this image. And then we're gonna be able to use the image for prompting ChatGPT. Right, so this is the prompt I have added. Can you identify the objects, describe the scene in this image and explain the image? This is the image URL and I have added the URL from that image. So this is one limitation you have to keep in mind and is that you cannot upload an image directly from your computer. You have to add a public URL where the image is available. All right, now click on generate and let's see if ChatGPT will be able to do this. So as you can see, you don't have to use any kind of function. And now, as you can see, ChatGPT is using the Scene Explain plugin. So you don't have to use any kind of function. You can just use natural language to be able to prompt ChatGPT. And now let's see if ChatGPT is able to understand what is on the image. The image features a joyful couple holding dollar bills against a vibrant yellow background. They are there casually and they are standing close to each other, clutching the notes with evident glee. So as you can read this uh, description, this is absolutely correct. And of course, then you can also ask questions about this image if this is a more detailed image, or you can use the inputs you have here to come up with social media captions or Facebook ad copy or anything like that. So if you want to see more application of this ChatGPT plugin or other ChatGPT plugins in general, make sure to check out my YouTube channel where I have a ton of tutorial. And if you want to see some other use cases and the best prompts you can use this plugin with, check out the article I have mentioned. And also, if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions, and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.